Hello friends, in this video you are going to learn about Somoyagi and dance phenomena. This is very important topic clinically as well as exam point of view. Because for diabetic patients, these both condition causes higher blood sugar levels in the morning but the reason and treatment are totally different. So for complete understanding, watch the full video. I will also tell trick to remember both phenomena. But mnemonics and tricks should not replace your concept. So we will discuss both concept followed by trick to remember. Firstly, Somogi phenomena. It is morning rebound hyperglycemia following an episode of hypoglycemia during midnight. It occurs due to release of counter regulatory hormones. It is most commonly due to high dose of evening, long or intermediate insulin like NPH. Let me explain graphically. Suppose at 7 pm high dose of NPH it administered. Its spike will come around 3 am which will cause midnight hypoglycemia. And due to this hypoglycemia, there is release of counter regulatory hormones which will cause early morning fasting hyperglycemia. So now treatment should be to reduce evening dose of NPH. Now how to remember this? Just remember friends, Somogi effect is due to so much insulin. So treatment is lower the evening insulin dose. Next is dawn phenomenon. As we discussed, both the phenomena have morning fasting hyperglycemia but in Down's phenomenon, there is no midnight hypoglycemia. The reason for Down phenomena is nocturnal surge of growth hormone release or increased clearance of insulin in the morning. Let me show graphically. Suppose at 7 pm, NPH is administered which is insufficient to maintain glucagon surge in midnight. So slowly, sugar levels will increase causing fasting hyperglycemia in the morning. So treatment should be to increase evening dose of NPH in contrast with reducing dose in Somogi phenomena. Now the trick to remember, dawn phenomena is due to down dosing of insulin. So treatment will be increasing evening dose of insulin. Now for revision, let's compare the graphs. In Somogi effect, there is midnight hypoglycemia followed by early morning hyperglycemia due to release of counter regulatory hormones. And in down effect, there is no midnight hypoglycemia but early morning hyperglycemia will be there due to low dose of evening insulin. So friends, this was all about Somogi and down phenomena. Do share this video among your friends. Also watch our other videos on various topics. Thank you.